Hey guys, what's up? It's Michael Zonkey. So I'm here on the newbie account now. Um, I know I showed a video of this account again for the first time in months a couple days ago. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to be playing on this account. And people said, oh, you sound pretty excited to play on this account. We'd like to see videos. So I have been playing on it a little bit, uh, mostly just slain. Again, I haven't been on this account too much, just like a little bit per day, I guess. Um, not a large amount, just because I've mostly just been uh, focusing on, you know, the Monk Zunky account, my main, trying to get that to 99 Divination, trying to get that Slayer XP up and stuff. So, um, yes, when I have been on this account, I have just been slain, and I just filled mine for an orange, which is pretty cool. On the very last kill of the task, that's kind of weird. But, um, yeah, I had greater demons that task, so unfortunately, this... This account does not have the stats to do, like, Zami, for example. I can't even wear a Staff of Light yet, so yeah, I can't do Zami. But um, I did have the stats to just go and kill regular Greater Demons. I'm going to try in the future, maybe, to try out Zami once I get a Staff of Light. Um, I don't know how well that would work. I think you might need some higher defense and all, because I'm only 71 defense. But we'll see how that works. So anyway, um, I'm just going to go get a new task from Simona. I keep forgetting I actually have Slayer Rings um, unlocked now, so I can teleport right to her. I keep doing the house teleport, and we get a Kurask's task. Um, I have 130 points. I could permanently ban that, but I'm not going to. That is an awful task, by the way, Kurask. They're just terrible, terrible XP. Um, really not very good to do. But I'm going to have to do it because um, I don't have very many tasks, and I want to make sure I have enough points to cancel some stuff if it gets really, really bad. Um, and Caress I think I could manage with. So I guess I'll show you guys my Slayer tab really quickly. Um, here in the front tab it's kind of a mess. I've been trying to force myself to do some Pyramid Plunder. Um, if we look at my stats I actually did get like one thieving level since coming back to this account so I got 68 thieving. But I don't know man, it's just kind of boring. I didn't really want to do Pyramid Plunder. I know it's kind of a lazy thing to say that but you know I've been motivated on my main account doing Divination again so I feel I would just give myself a break on this account. Um, I also haven't been doing ports, I really should do those, and this is just energy that I got from Divination, and uh, I don't really know where these things came from. But my Slayer tab is here, so I do now have the Slayer rings unlocked, I didn't have those unlocked in the last episode. So, um, the top half of the tab looks much the same as it did in the previous episode, but I have gotten some drops. Don't need this Karask, I, I can probably just drop that, I'll never ever use it. But um, some of this stuff... I guess this Slayer tab probably isn't worth a whole lot. I got two Mystic Robe Bottom and a Mystic Robe Top drop. I think the Robe Tops are from Karas and the Robe Bottoms are from Taroths. I'm pretty sure that's how it is. Correct me if I'm wrong. But it's weird because on my main account, um, I did a ton of Taroth tasks because I used Simona for a long, long time. And I never, ever got a single Mystic Robe Bottom. And I've had two and two tasks of them, so that's a bit weird. But anyway, as you can see, this Slayer tab here, I don't know how much it's worth. Probably maybe 5 mil at most. Um... I'm guessing it's not worth a whole lot. Okay, I have to price check the Slayer tab. I pulled out pretty much anything that had any value in the Slayer tab. But yeah, you know me and my price checks. I just gotta do them. It's kind of just my thing. But anyway, um, I actually don't think this is gonna add up to 5 mil. Because, oh, maybe those dwarf weeds are gonna be worth quite a bit. 680k. I don't know how I got that many dwarf weeds. I haven't been farming them or anything. Um, so that's a bit weird. But, oh, dwarf weed seeds as well. Those are just worth bank. Um, so I got 67 dwarf wheat somehow. Not exactly sure how that happened. And uh, yeah, this is going to actually add up to be quite a bit more than I expected. So um, almost 5 mil. That's 4.8 mil. And then what's left in the Slayer tab can easily add up to the rest of the 5 mil. Those fungal flakes are worth hardly anything. If I knew they were that cheap, I might have not picked them up. But anyway, um, this is pretty much my Slayer tab. Some of the nicer drops are like the the dragon, dragon bones, I guess, the rune chain bodies, stuff like that. Um, definitely those two half of a keys are worth bank. The dwarf weeds, I think that's the most expensive single item stack in my tab, I believe. But um, I haven't been slain very long, and you got to remember this slayer tab isn't from 1 to 77 slayer, because I'm 77 slayer at the moment. This slayer tab is like from... 71 to 77 slayer or something like that so it's not from that much xp i would say it's from about 500k slayer xp or so so uh slayer is not terrible money i just gotta throw that out there
Alright, so it's time to kill the Karasks, and I believe I'm all geared up. What's really bad about this task is you have to use this leaf-bladed spear to kill them, um, and it doesn't have the highest accuracy, even though they're supposedly weak to the leaf-bladed spear, um, it still doesn't have very good accuracy at all. And also, they're weak to, like, air spells, but um, if you use the Slayer Staff, you have to use the Slayer Dart spell, uh, which is kind of expensive to use, and it's also kind of crap, so... Um, there's really no reason to mage them. It's much better than melee them, even though um, the accuracy is sometimes a problem. But anyways, yeah, this is the Karasks. They're kind of crap XP. Like, they have a lot of health, and yet they only give, like, 94... Not 94, they only give 115 Slayer XP per kill, um, which is really bad considering um, the amount of time it takes to kill them and the amount of health that they have. Um, so that's kind of a flaw. Sometimes there's monsters that are much stronger than others that will give the same amount of XP uh, for no real reason. Sometimes monsters, they just don't have a lot of health, but they give more XP than they should. And there's other monsters like the Kurasks that have more health, but they don't give as much XP as they should for the amount of health that they have. Um, so that's kind of frustrating, but anyway, um, I can't wait to get my chaotic weapons. I can't even wield chaotic yet because I'm only 76 attack, but um, right now I'm training defense because I really want to get to that um, level 160 combat as soon as possible so I can start using Curadel for getting my Slayer tasks, um, but until then... I'm just going to be stuck with Simona, but I, once I get level 80 attack, I'll probably train to 78 defense and then just go right back to attack or something like that um, and just get to 80 and then try to get my chaotic claws as soon as possible. Um, I did actually pass 80 dungeoneering as well. I think in the last video I made on this account, I was like 77 or 78 dungeoneering. And now I'm 81 Dungeoneering, so I did a little bit of Dungeoneering, um, and that was fun. But anyway, thanks guys for watching. Um, kind of a, just a bit of a progress video here. And yeah, this is what I do on this account. I slay for days. Farewell.